This is WOWT 6 News 10 at 10. A Valley, Nebraska woman goes missing with her sister. It all happened roughly two weeks ago. Tonight, some amazing news. We know she's alive and well. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Jessica Gill. And I'm Matthew Smith. Now, those women were far from home. How far, you ask? Try 15 hours away from Valley, Nebraska. Uh, that Valley woman's son traveled a long way to be there tonight when her mom was rescued. Our Chase Moffitt with more on how this story unfolded. It is tonight's big story. I was able to hug my mom right as she got off of the helicopter and then as she was going onto the ambulance and my aunt as well. Raw emotions and pure relief for Dennis Roy. His mother Leslie found with her sister Lee Marie Wright alive today in the remote wilderness of northern Michigan. They were very elated. Uh, when uh, uh, Lee Wright was clutching to her Bible and uh, and they were very appreciative to be found. The sisters missing since April 11th and found by helicopter were still with their car. It was stuck near Crisp Point on Lake Superior. So we started to circle, then they got out of the vehicle and started waving their hands and were trying to, uh, trying to build a uh, fire quickly to uh, signal to us that they were down there. They're uh, both joking around and being able to have conversations with people. Roy describes his mother and his aunt in good spirits despite their weakened condition. Rescue teams were forced to land the heli on a beach and hike in about an hour to reach them. But what do you eat to survive in the wild for two weeks? Eight uh, boxes of Girl Scout cookies that they had purchased uh, from a family member on the way over. Uh, they had been stopping at several family members uh, and also they uh, had cheese puffs, um, and that's what they survived on. Hmm. Harrowing tale. Now, Sergeant Rawson described Roy and Wright's conditions as, quote, a little weak, but alive and well. Wright is from Oklahoma. Roy here in Valley, Nebraska. Now, the pair had been visiting family and driving throughout the state. Authorities were made aware of them becoming missing after they didn't make it to Mackinac City to spend the night there. Matt and Jessica. All right, thanks for the story, Chase. State police say they were searching with a helicopter when they saw light reflecting off their white Ford Explorer. Tonight, the two women are in a hospital recovering. No word yet on when they plan that long trip home.